this three, four, five. Hey there guys, Abner's Reviews here, back with another unboxing, and today we would be playing with the Nerf Alpha Strike Flight CS10. So this is our Alpha Strike Flight CS10 right here. A really good looking Nerf gun right here. There's our Nerf branding right here. And of course, this is for kids age eight and up. Caution warning right there. And this comes with 20X Nerf Elite darts. And of course, our Hasbro branding right there. Okay, on the back, that is how our Nerf gun looks like so we have here the trigger and on this one we have the removable clip for our darts right here and that is our gun barrel right there of course this is for your shoulders gun grip right there and the 20x elite nerf darts so let us continue with our unboxing So there you go guys with our Nerf Alpha Strike Flight CS10. So I have to mention that this time they have included a uh, manual right here. That is because this is the first Nerf gun that is battery operated which we will be reviewing on our channel. So what we got from the box is our manual right here. There a two pager. Our 20 Elite Nerf Darts right here. Right here guys. So we have 20 of these. And our Alpha Strike Flight oh. CS10 right here. So let's start here. So this is for your shoulders. So you can push this against your shoulders. It's really sturdy. Those, it's still plastic but it really feels tough so this will help you in your targeting when you're firing the gun still is predominantly plastic but it's really a good grip right here and we have the nerf branding right there we have our normal trigger right here we have our mag release right here and we have our acceleration button right here just below our trigger so on top that is our scope a combination of yellow black and orange right there wow. and there is a hatch right here which comes off when needed if ever there is a jam of course that's just for emergencies you have to keep that close at all times because if you don't close it the gun will not fire so this is our gun barrel right here that really looks good and just below that is our battery pack right here the orange one this is where we will put in the batteries for our nerf gun and of course this is the magazine or the mag it will hold 10 darts for us at a time hence the number right there 10 so this is a great looking nerf gun right here perfect so now i'm going to show you about the magazine so to pop out the magazine 
you press on this button right here, the one in front of the trigger, so it would be released and you can get it out, like so. So you press on this and you get the magazine out. So you can only put this back one way and this is the way you have taken it out. You cannot put this another way. It will not fit that hole right there. So the number 10 should be aligned like this. What we have to do is fill this with our darts, right? So we'll fit in 10 of these on our magazine right here. So to fill the darts, you just have to press after each one. You can press here so you lower the spring. So we have 10 darts on our magazine right here. So we'll pop it back on like so. If you want, you can still push the button right here, but it's not necessary. If you put this the same way you took it out, then it should be no problem popping it back in. But for safety measures, just push the button so it's easier. Our magazine is loaded, so there you go. Now we are putting in our batteries. So as I've mentioned, this is the battery pack right here, the orange part on the front of our gun. So all you have to do is flip it on the other side and you will see this hatches right here. So all you need to do, so push this down and there's a clip right here on the left side. You just have to push it inwards. So pull this down, right? Like so. You will, you will hear a sound when you successfully pull it down. Right there. And then you pull on the sides. Right here. And that is our battery compartment right there. Actually, when I first opened it, I was really concerned. Because it was, it's really just plastic right here. Connecting the two plastics together as well. So there's a potential for these to be worn out every time you open it. So I would suggest that you do not open this battery compartment unless you really have to. Okay, so now we put on our batteries. So we need to put four AA batteries on our Nerf Alpha Strike Flight CS10 right here. So all we need to do is just follow the polarity right here. So there you go. Our batteries are all set right here. So we close it like so. Make sure that one clips on right there, real tight. So you might have to pull it down a little bit. So you'll get it clipped on right there. So this one is now operational. We have batteries in here and we have our magazine loaded right there. So I think all we have to do right now is fire our Alpha Strike Flight CS10 right here by pulling our trigger. So this time there's no pump action because we are using a fully motorized Nerf gun right here. Okay, so first, before I fire the gun, I failed to mention that this part on our scope or our sight right here, there are accessories that can be bought to attach a scope right here. So we will be looking into those accessories as we review more Nerf guns in the future and as well as other standard magazines like this one with, with higher capacities in terms of nerf darts that they hold. So we will be looking into those. So now we are ready to fire the gun. Are you ready? I'll just make sure that the magazine is properly inserted right there before you fire the gun. So when you fire the gun, this is really not a fully automatic 
Nerf gun. So you still have to fire the trigger once at a time, but you don't have to load it or cock the gun because this is motorized. So you push the acceleration button right here, just below the trigger. So this is our main trigger, right? So just below it, our acceleration button right here. So when you push it, you will hear the sound. You hear that? That means our Nerf gun is working and you can now pull your trigger right here. So are you ready? So look look in here in our barrel as a I would fire right here. So push the acceleration button right here and then we fire, okay? <laughs> so that is 10 darts right there, guys. Wow. This is a very great experience for me. This is my first time firing a motorized Nerf gun right here. So I'm really overjoyed. Wow, that is great. Wow. So now it's time for our power test. So this is our flight CS10 right here. And that is our normal target. Just the paper and shoebox. So now we will fire from six feet back and see if we can put a dent to our target using our first motorized Nerf gun right here, the Flight CS-10. Ready? <laughs> wow, what an action right there. But unfortunately, our target remains unscarred right there. It's still good. No holes, even with a motorized Nerf gun right here. So wow, this is really a great experience and I hope you liked it too, guys. So there we go with our Nerf gun for the day. So this is a really, really fun Nerf gun right here. And this is the first motorized Nerf gun that we have reviewed on Abner's Reviews. So this has been a lot of fun. This is my first time as well. So any of you first timers, right there, in terms of motorized blasting for Nerf guns, this was a literal blast for me. As a feedback, you should push this up, the magazine, because it has a tendency to, you know, drop a couple of centimeters below. And if that drops, the, the gun will not fire. So just a quick little tip right there. But this has been a lot of fun. This gun also has a weight to it because of the batteries and the way the gun is built as well. So this is a really, really cool, fun Nerf gun to have. So there you go. So right now, which Nerf gun do you have on your collection? I hope you have this one because this is a really good one. Perfect. So I hope you ha have this one on your collection. But if you don't have this one, which ones do you have? Please comment it down below, okay? And do not forget that we are still on our 3,500 subscribers giveaway. For more info on that, click on the link right here and on our video description. So there you go guys. Please do not forget to like and comment on our videos. If you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing to Abner's Reviews. Do not forget to click on the notification bell, select all, it will get notified when we upload another one of our Nerf gun reviews or any of our other normal video uploads. Also follow us on our social media links right here. And that's been it. This is Nerf Reviews and I will catch you guys on the next one.